What's up guys, I'm Drago Von, sunny San Diego, California. Let's take a ride with me, okay? Let's go guys. Let's go. Hey guys, uh, I'm here in San Diego, California, summertime. Um, I would like to give you guys some tips in Jiu Jitsu and how to learn Jiu Jitsu faster. And um, I'll give some tips for you guys and hopefully those tips can help you through your Jiu Jitsu journey. Uh, most of the questions that I'll put right here and the answers that I'll give you guys are for white belts. All the color belts can take this as a, as a lesson as well because you need to have the white belt mind to keep learning, you know, every single day, every day, all the time. I think that's the most important thing, okay? All right, here we go, let's go to the first question. First question is, uh, how can I learn BJJ faster? A lot of people ask me that, you know, like, oh, I wanna learn really fast, like, how can I do that? I think the best way for you to learn Jiu Jitsu faster is more time you train, faster you learn, of course. But I think, in my opinion, Private lessons will help you a lot, okay? When you are one-on-one -on -one with your coach or with anyone that, or whoever is teaching you, person with more experience than you, always will guide you, right? When you're in the class, the regular class, you're gonna have maybe a few minutes one-on-one -on -one with your coach. If the class is really full, really packed, it's gonna be hard for you to have a time one-on-one -on -one with your coach, right? So pretty much you spend like around 10 to 15 minutes teaching technique to everyone, you don't have that time to make a question for him. Like a private question, you know? Sometimes because the guy is running around, watching uh, his students, you know? So I think like, it's very, very important for anyone to do private. So I did private lessons with my coach, Fernando did around, for around like two years, two years and a half. Every day, we used to spend time together uh, drilling techniques, I was making questions, was teaching me, and I think that helped me as, as a, an athlete, as a fighter, but also helped me as a coach, you know, as a teacher. And you definitely learn when somebody teach you, and you definitely can teach someone when you learn, you know. So I think it's very, very important for you to spend as much as you can one-on-one -on -one with someone more experienced than you. That's the first thing, and I think also the training amount. If you train once a week, of course, you're not gonna have the same improvement of someone that trains three, four times a week. So I think when you put more time on the mat, for sure you can learn faster. You need to manage your time of drilling and the time of rolling, especially for a white belt, because the white belt, his body is not ready to get a lot of amount of rolls. You gotta be careful and watch out to not get hurt. I think like half and a half, you know? to do drills and uh, sparring. Let's say one example, you train like five times a week. Maybe like half of this should be like amount of timing of drilling and half of this amount of time of uh, sparring, you know? So pretty much if your class is one hour, half an hour drilling, half an hour sparring. Especially in the beginning, you know? You need to know the techniques. You need to know what you're doing. You need to physically be ready for the for the role, you know? So if you don't drill, you're not gonna have enough strength to control the situation that you're working. So that's my tip. Private lessons, for sure, 100%. Time one-on-one -on -one with uh, someone more experienced than you. Making questions, for sure. And I think the private is a great time for you to make those questions because sometimes the coach doesn't have a time during the class. And train. Train Jiu-Jitsu as much as you can, as much as possible. And then you're gonna improve much, much better, okay?